when is the best time of year to sell my house in Campbell River? I get this question all the time from sellers here in Campbell River. So when is the best time of the year to sell your house? Hi, this is Yuda Trenati, local real estate agent in Campbell River, BC on Vancouver Island. I get calls, emails, and texts all the time about people asking me this question. So here we go. All right, so you're thinking about selling and you want to achieve the quickest sale at the highest price, right? Well, that is what everybody wants when they are selling their home. And there are certain times that it could be better than others throughout the year, depending on your situation. But do keep in mind that if you're priced correctly, staged well, and with the right marketing, the time of year isn't really going to have that much of an effect on the final outcome of your sale. Well, with that said, let's start with our spring market. Now to catch the spring market, you'd be looking to list anywhere between the end of February through May, though this can change from year to year. For example, in 2022, our spring market or our busy season was more like January to March instead of February to May. Spring is the most popular time as it is when the winter is over, school year is starting to come to an end, and that is when a lot of people are looking to make their move. At this time of the year, we have the most buyers out there actively looking for a home. After we get through the spring market, summer usually mellows down a little bit, which bring up, brings us to what is typically considered the second best time to sell, fall market. After the summer, kids are back in school, families are, are back from their vacations and ready to start looking for a home. This is going to be anywhere from the beginning of September through early November. And this can also be a good time to list with many people looking to move or make their move before Christmas or, or the new year. What we're going to do now is we're going to, go, going to look at some of the pros and cons of selling at different times of the year. So here we go. Spring market pros. Highest number of buyers out in the market looking for a home. The weather is starting to warm up and we're starting to get green grass and leaves on trees, which look good when showcasing your home. Spring market cons. There's more inventory to compete with, so buyers will be looking at more homes before they make a decision, which also means more showings and more time spent out of the house for sellers. In the spring market, there's a fair chance that a lot of your flowers or shrubs, shrubs may not have bloomed yet, so it is not the best season to showcase your yard. On to the fall market from September to November. The pros here would be that people are settling down from their summer plans and are back ready to look at homes. There's also less inventory typically than the spring and the summer, meaning less competition for you and less choice for those buyers, which is good for sellers. Cons for the fall market would be that your landscaping is probably starting not to look as good as it did in the summer. There are also typically fewer buyers in this market than when we were in the spring market. Selling in the fall means a likely moving date in November or December when it could get cold. And that brings us to our winter market from December to February. Winter market pros. The nice thing about selling in the dead of winter is that only buyers that are there looking at homes in the cold, rain, possibly snow are going to be the ones that are very serious about buying. You're going to have far less looky-loos during these winter months. Cons. It's cold, it's miserable, it's raining, and it gets dark early. Moving in the winter is no fun. And let's be honest, your house and your yard doesn't look great. Finally, our last selling period is the summertime from June to August. Pros. Your yard is likely the most beautiful, which is great for photos, video, and showings. We get a lot of tourists and visitors in the summertime, and often these people fall in love with our town and decide to look for properties here. Cons, people taking vacations and distracted from buying a home, and that one won't be their top priority during these summer months. More looky-loos, and buyers with kids wanting a very quick close to move in before the start of September. Now, all things considered, there really isn't a one-size-fits-all best time to sell your home here in Campbell River. You gotta weigh out the pros and the cons of each time frame and decide which is going to work for you and your situation. So if you're planning to sell your home in Campbell River, I'd love to have a chat and help you determine 
to determine what time of year is going to be the best for you to sell your home. You can also click the link below for a free home evaluation to start the process or feel free to just give me a call or text anytime. My contact information is below. I'll see you in the next video.